Take it from me, here are issues that could affect your chances of getting audited as an ex-IRS agent. Number one, discrepancies or errors. Make sure you report all your W-2s, 1099s, 1098s that you receive because the IRS also gets a copy of them and report them on your tax return correctly. Number two, large deductions and unusual deductions. Make sure if you're claiming large or unusual deductions on your tax return, you have the proof. Number three, claiming a home office. If you claim the home office deduction, make sure you use the space regularly and exclusively for your business. Number four, business losses. Make sure if you're claiming losses from your business year after year, it's definitely a business and not a hobby. IRS does not like hobbies and all your expenses will be thrown out. Number five, large cash transactions. If you have reported a large cash transaction, which is not consistent with all your other income, it may be a red flag. Number six, self-employed. Being self-employed will definitely increase your chances of being audited because the IRS will likely want to change your expenses being claimed. So make sure you could prove with documentation the expenses you're claiming on your Schedule C. Number seven, foreign accounts. If you have a foreign account in another country and the balance is over $10,000, make sure you report it on your tax return because the IRS knows about it. Number eight, random selection, national research program. Sometimes your return is selected by the IRS for audit because they just want to update their computers. Be aware, you could be next. But if everything is correct on your return and you can prove it, don't worry. And follow us for more tax tips.